All right, we got Red Hot Casey Leonard with us here. Uh, he's going to talk about his drive on Fort Silky. Uh, Casey, you, you use this one multiple times. Uh, you, you you win a 27 and one first quarter, and then you you yielded, and then you retook. Um, how good was this one tonight, Case? I, I'd never drove him before that I remember, but he was. I mean, he's a class horse. You look at his lines, and he. Uh, really got out of there well and I thought we'd have him lined up and then Johnny came at us really hard so I I mean I got a lot of respect for shark wave so I let him go but he uh looked like he was laboring just a little bit and then I come back and waited for the straightaway and it just worked out so did it uh did it ever go through your mind to go ahead and and uh sit sit behind John I thought about it he didn't really have a big hold of shark waves the lines were kind of flopping so I thought I I elected to try to get around him, so that's just what it looked like out there with the lines not really up in the bits, not up in the horse's mouth. So, thought all just right, take a shot. sounds good, Casey. You said this is the first time you think you drove this one. Um, I, I mean, he was a little leg weary in the stretch. How much did he have coming for home? Uh, he got up on him when I asked him in the turn. He really stepped it up and paced away, and then down the lane. I mean, he was. I mean, he was. Uh, I don't know if he was necessarily waiting on him, but I think he was. Uh, he was tired. That's for sure. All right, sounds good for Casey Leonard. Thanks, Case. This is Jeremy Day for the Illinois Harness Horsemen's Association, live at Maywood Park. We'll send it back up to you, Joe.